Hello everyone, Don the Lazy Gamer here, or you can just call me Don for short, and welcome back to some more Dying Light 2, and uh, I had to go back and revise some of my stuff, but we do have some new pants. No, oh, wait. We do have some new pants. They look, uh, they look a little raggedy in my opinion, but hey, they're good pants, see? Decent, decent, decent pants. Now, uh, I haven't done anything, you know, since the last episode, so, uh, I do want to go and check this out real quick. I already have it marked on the uh, mini-map, because, uh, I missed it last time we were over there in the, this Houndfield area. There's also a few other spots I missed. Wow, good God. But there's a lot of secret little passageways and trinkets around here but i want to go back to the old hospital real quick and find out what this stuff is so let's go ahead and head out i know there's some stuff down here i need to check out as well let's hop down here and check what this is real quick oh my god be careful oh you freaking aiden you schnut oh my god uh don't mind me zombos i just need to get down here without getting my bacon ate please what is this Military convoy, scavenge weapons, gear, and ammo. Which means there's probably gonna be people like that. Fantastic. Uh, listen guys, come on now. Come on now. There, there, there's no need in all this. Climb up, Aiden, what the heck is wrong with you, dude? Don't need your bacon getting ate. Okay, so um, it's probably those chests down there. But there's a lot of spawnbies right here. Uh, I'm probably gonna take care of this later because Lord have mercy. For now, let's just head back to that hospital and see what this is all about real quick. What is this? What? What is this? What? Uh, what? Oh! It's a hook to get back up to the windmill. Nice! Alright. Anyways, let's head off. Uh, that's what we gotta get on top of, so... How am I... Okay, I see this. Oh, this is gonna be complicated. Oh my god, uh... There wouldn't happen to me a mattress or something down there, would there? Oh my god, catch it. Aiden, oh my god, dude. Oh my god, just go. Good god, dude. You're gonna end up getting me killed. You can't scare me. Who, who said that? Who said that? Hello, sir! <laughs> oh, so sorry. Where's that container at? Oh, don't tell me it's below me. That would, like, really suck. Oh, there's also another one over here, too. But I'm not going to that one right now. I'm going to this one. Okay, I'm definitely gonna have to come back and get all this stuff at some point. Easy does it now. Okay, so how uh, how do I get on the top of this building? Can I even do it at my current level? Just passing through. Excuse me. Oh my god. Why are there so many of the? Okay, encounter. Let's go to this encounter real quick. Just look how many there are. Look up. Lord have mercy. Is there just people I gotta kill or something? Yep. You know, Aiden, when you do stupid crap like that, just kill him. Look at the gore. Come on. Come on. Try it. Come on. You suck. And bye bye to your partner. Oh, wait. This is bullcrap. I'm stuck. I'm good. Uh oh. And he called in reinforcements. Fantastic. Oh my god, that's a bow. Come on. You suck. Oh my god, that's so awesome. Okay, so. Shoot that arrow. Come on. So much that did for you, huh? Also, where did that bow and arrow go? I want it. Is there another dude? I want that bow and arrow, please. Ooh, that was close. I'm a shield. What the? Hello. You're stupid. <laughs> uh, Lockpicks. Haha, <laughs> got it. Alright, what do we got in here? Cricket back, flower. Uh, I'll take the cricket back just in case I need it. Alright, back to what I was doing. Uh, how do I get up there without getting my bacon ate? I think I found a way up there before, but. No, no, that was another building. Never mind. You watch your language, young sir. I'm trying to do something. Now, see, if you're strong enough, Aiden, you j I'd just say, dude, just climb over there that way, but no. Can't be able to make that jump, probably. Oh, a traitor. Hello. I got flour. Uh, no, not really. It showed somebody with a side mission? Hello, sir. Your design. I did get it in St. Joseph's. Why? I design my idea, although... No, the one you're wearing is slightly different from the one I put together during the summer of 20. 
2024. Yes, the original biomarker was much more useful. What's an inventor doing in a trading outpost? You invented biomarkers? What are you doing in this trading post then? Sciencing trade. What did you think? That's called capitalism. Right, and look what it led us anyway. Would you be interested in the original biomarker? Like I said, far more useful than the ones we're wearing now. How is it more useful? All right, I'm interested. Keep talking. How is it special? Ooh, where should I start? So, beyond monitoring the concentration of THV infectious agents in your blood, the initial biomarker organically enhanced the synthesis of phosphocreatine, providing phosphates to ADP molecules and stimulating the... Whoa, whoa, whoa. English, please. It made people stronger and faster. Then why is it not being used? Okay, now you have my attention. How come people aren't using this model, then? Let's say there were minor side effects. Such as? Doesn't matter. What matters is my obnoxious rival, Dr. Katsumi Kobayachi, then head of the GRE, deemed it too dangerous. She locked it up in a safe somewhere inside that building over there. St. Joseph's Hospital? Exactly. I can see you're not that fresh in the city. Wanna know how to open the safe and get my original biomarker? Sure. I found a note on Katsumi's desk. Seems like she encrypted the code of the safe through some sort of riddle. What's the riddle? What becomes smaller when you turn it upside down? That's the first digit of the safe. Yes. The second one is an odd number. Take away a letter and it becomes even. What number is it? And the third one? A little girl goes to the store and buys one dozen eggs. As she is going home, all but three eggs break. How many eggs are left unbroken? Now, find the safe in Katsumi's office in St. Joseph's Hospital and use these three digits to open it. You should find my biomarker inside of it. There's the note with the riddle in case you need more time. Okay, uh, really the last one was the easiest one, but uh, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna wait to do that because that sounds like really complicated. So for now, I'm gonna focus on getting on top of the building and seeing what all those question marks are about. Thank you, thank you very much, sir. Now, how do I make it up there again without breaking every bone in my body? Because it's not showing like a little spot for me to climb up at or anything. I'm not gonna have to like go inside the hospital, right? And somebody's in trouble again. See, this hasn't changed much. I'm coming, dude, I'm coming to save your strife. Hey, I'll leave this guy alone. Yep. He's a, oh, you suck! Hit me with that crap. Come on. You suck. <laughs> oh, that is so cool. Well, let's hurry up and get you untied before he gets eats my bacon. You stupid hazmat dude. Hurry up and get him untied. Uh oh. No, 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 no. Got you untied, dude. What is this? I'll take that. And get oh my god! Ha, ah, dude, seriously, you kidding? Oh no, this isn't good. It's already becoming nighttime. Get out of my face! I like how the virals are easier to kill, so that's fun. Still, I would like to know how to get up on top of this uh, freaking building. This isn't good. We need to get back to a safe house fast. We got this. Nothing to worry about. Okay, maybe just a little bit to worry about. Oh my god. Please, go. Aiden. Yeah, screw that crap. Go to sleep, Aiden. You freaking schnite. Okay, so I have successfully done nothing. I guess I'm gonna have to wait for the, uh, hospital. Good night and good luck. Little hint to Don like one there. I guess, uh, we'll wait for that. 
We still got a few more question marks over here I want to fiddle with. And I think the only way to get to the top of that is to go through the building. And uh, the building's a dark area, so I'm going to have to go in there at nighttime, which is going to be really complicated. I should have actually went in there now, but uh, I want to wait until I get a, just a you know, touch better tools before going to do that. So, we're going to go adventure some other place. So we got another rest area over here. Let's go to this question mark and check some things out then. Oh god, Aiden, please grab it. Please grab it. Aiden, you not. Oh, Aiden, you idiot. You stupid fool. You know, this is why nobody likes you. All right, let's try doing this again, shall we? This time, grab the rope, Aiden. Thank you. Okay, what's up with the question mark over here? Another freaking night activity. Fantastic. Man, I can't do anything. Okay, is this going into the dark area still? I think it is. Ooh, it's right there. I'm gonna try it. Just gotta be extra sneaky. Yeah, yeah, I see it. Grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. Get out of here. Move! Get, get, get out! Go, 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 Aiden! Go, go, Aiden! Aiden, get out of the corner! Go! Hoo! 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 We got inhibitors. We got inhibitors. Oh my god. Oh lord. Okay, stay in my health. Uh, let's uh, apply through the inhibitors. Uh, let's go health. Lord have mercy. Okay, screw that. Let's go on to this one. Okay, so they've added a lot more night activities, I see. Good job, Aiden. You broke your cankles. I'm guessing another night, yeah. Wow, I'll, there are a lot of those. Oh my, a new hideout. Fantastic. Okay, it's always good to have all of these here. Prepare. Nice! <laughs> Alright. I think that's enough fiddling around. I'm gonna go do this story mission, and I'll save most of these night runs and stuff for another video. We'll probably knock a handful of them out of each video with the story missions. Okay, who's getting their bacon ate this time? God dang, dude. That was not a, okay. I got you, sir. Bye bye to your kinkles. I'll take that. Thank you. Hello. You suck. What the heck? Wait, you didn't give me my stuff. What the heck is that? Gremlin? Okay, I need to go and heal. I need to go and heal. You got this, right, dude? Just cl Aiden, climb the freaking building. Okay. Heal, Aiden. Good God, please heal. What does this do? I got 15 to beat. Uh, it does not sound like that dude's doing too well. Okay. Heal real quick. Uh, make another med kit. Nice. All right. And our weapon's broken. Fantastic. All right, let's go do the story mission, shall we? If Aiden doesn't break his cankles. I miss being able to jump over their heads. Don't mind me, spumbos. That's it, Aiden. Come on, bud. There you go. Someone's been stealing our water. Nobody's doing anything about it. Such a shame. Look around. You see this? The city? It's not dead. It's just waiting to be revived. By God, it's what we'll do. Okay. Pilgrim, take my advice. Leave the city before... See what happens when... I got you. You're welcome. What? What the heck? Well, tell me what you're gonna tell me. Really? That's it? Oh, for God's sake. I'm gonna just leave so much stuff going on at once. Alright. Uh, ooh. That's disgusting. I'll take it. Knock, knock. Oh. Well. Oh, lovely. What is this? Help. Pilgrim needed. Survivor missions. To reward you for helping people to survive apocalyptic hellscapes, survivor missions reward you with tokens. Gotcha. Need recommended rank three through nine. I'm level one. Uh, yeah. Uh, I'll get to that later. <laughs> Wait, what's the recommended level for this mission? One. Okay, we're good.
Knock knock. Are these the people who tried hanging me earlier? Jesus, you're the one who bumped into me. No freaking way I can do it. What is it? Side mission. Okay, what's wrong? What's the problem? Hey, aren't you the pilgrim they wanted to hang? Matt, you were in luck there. I could use some of that luck. I'm Alberto's apprentice. Not for long, probably. It's the third time I'm taking a shot at this test. If I fail again, Craftmaster Alberto's gonna kick me out. What's a Craftmaster? Hey, what's a Craftmaster? You're not from around here, right? Craftmasters are people who invent new technology, design innovations, all sorts of gadgets that might help in combat. Alberto's the Grand Master around here. Like I said, I'm his apprentice. People laugh at him, that he's slow and not very eloquent, but he's a real friggin' genius. What's this test about? What's this test about? Our goats. They're kept in cages because they eat crops. But life in cages makes them sad, and they give less milk. So I came up with the idea of a fence, energized with just a tiny bit of voltage. That would keep the goats under control, but let them produce more milk. I called this invention the electric fence. Wow, really? That's a little rough. Yeah, that's a little rough. Stressed goats can give bitter milk. Seriously? Goats get stressed? Wouldn't you, if someone electrocuted you and then went for your crotch? Oh, no. It's only a very small voltage. Won't do more than tickle them. So what's your problem? So, what seems to be the problem with this invention of yours? I just need some electric parts. I'll dismantle them for resistors and other useful things. I'm missing a few parts, and they're not that easy to get. I'm worried I won't be ready on time. Maybe you could help me. If you find them for me, I'll give you one of my super cool inventions. Nothing to do with goats, I hope. Nah, something much more interesting. You'll see, as far as I know, they could be found in two places. One's an old hardware store on Fitzwilliam Place, near the water tower. Alberto says they'll be there for sure, but it's a dark place, full of turned creatures. Of course. Tonight. And the other option? Whatever's left of military patrols. I know of one place south of Horseshoe, near the old electrical substation. Yeah, I'll see what I can do. But I can't promise anything. I would be very grateful. Gotcha, gotcha. Oh my god, there are so many freaking... I mean, that's dying light for you. So many side missions. Not good. I've been here and there. You know, the best part is always happening in the center. And that's where we're going. I have a plan for how to get there. I'll tell you everything on the spot. Meet me on the roof near the main metro station. Gotcha. I gotta talk to this dude first, so give me a second. Don't recognize me? Or are you allergic to making money? Listen, Pilgrim. We can make a killing, you and me. You just need to get me some beets, radishes, parsnips. There he is. Grab him, Ed. He's a murderer. What? Julian, Luke's been poisoned. From the water you sold him, Bevan says. Uh -oh. What? But I don't sell water. Liar. Luke told me he got it from you. Whatever's in it has him ranting and raving now. You're sure he didn't blame me after he started ranting? What's your proof? Maybe he's a little suspicious. What's your proof? Oh, well, wait a minute. Do you have proof? Of course. The water came in a bottle. Luke got that water in one of your bottles. When I tell Carl about this, you'll hang! Bevan, wait! I swear, I don't even sell water, damn it! If you're lying, Julian, you're fucking toast! How about you? Yeah, it could have been one of. You never know if somebody's framed up, you freaking schnutz! Swear to God. Alright, dude. 
Alright, so then, if you're not selling water, how'd someone get a hold of one of your bottles? Knowing that shithead Luke, he probably stole it. That would be like him. Even if he did, my water's pure as melted snowflakes. Thought she didn't sell water. Maybe he stored it improperly? You sure? How do you store it? I buy bottles. There's no way it could become contaminated. Not a chance. My supplier, Marco, always has clean water. Maybe this is revenge? So, uh, maybe it's revenge. For what? Everyone loves me. Never had an enemy in my life. Wait a second. Wait. Shit. Except maybe Marco. That bastard. Come to think of it, he's got an axe to grind for me. It was a long time ago. Never mind. Listen. He lives above an old shop on the west end of Villador on Houndfield Lane. I traded him a few kilos of my finest flour for the water. Prove he poisoned it and half my flour is yours. Can you do that for me? Flour? I guess I could check it oh, out. yeah. Valuable. There's one more thing. I'm a little embarrassed. Hans might also have a bottle of this water. I thought you weren't selling it. I'm not, except, well, to Hans and... Can you go warn him? He's also on Hanfield, a few buildings down. Something's fishy about this, Julian. Look, you better be telling the truth, otherwise it'll be hard to help you. Yeah, you better be telling the truth. Swear to God, man. See this trusty little bat I got in my backpack? I'm gonna crack it right over your noggin. Okay, continuing on. One more so- Ooh, craftsman, craftsman, craftsperson. Gotcha, gotcha. Like what you see, eh? Don't you talk dirty to me, sir. Okay, so I can buy ammunition. I don't have a bow and freaking arrow, so I can't do that. I can upgrade. I can upgrade my freaking medicine? Hold up. Hold up. Healing bomb of moderate. Yes, please. Yeah, oh, well, if it can heal me better, I'll definitely take it. Click weapon blueprints by... Uh, gotcha. Yeah, well, I know, but you just freaking told me about it. Okay, so craft weapons. I can craft a last hope magicium into hander. And I can repair weapons. All damage weapons can be repaired. The dirt costs it over. Gotcha. Okay, so what's it cost to repair? Wait. Okay, so I need to... It doesn't take scrap anymore. You need to literally go out and find the freaking crap to fit. I mean, I could just go out and find new weapons for all... Never mind. Okay, that's pretty cool though. Upgrading all that. Just check all the. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got another merchant here. In Carnage Hall, the strongest of the strong will face off. Got any good clothing? Jesus Christ! 489? Uh, sir, I don't have that much money. Where's my money? Uh, I don't know how much money I got. 599. Yeah, that that's gonna drug, make me go broke now. You trying to. Lord, I'm missing. Alright, let's get on. What we were doing. Lord, why is it so dark? What the? Oh. Cool. God oh, dang it. Okay, so he's a bit further away than I thought. Hey, knock it off. A note for dying light. Who's just, who was just talking? Little note for dying light. Always want to uh, take the roofs if you can. What is this? Parkour challenge. Gotcha. Oh, don't fall, Aiden. My God, dude, you're gonna have make me have a heart attack at some point. I swear. Oh, another land mill. Yeah, yeah, good for the inhibitor container. I want this land mill, please. Oh, well, I'm just gonna. <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and open this. Don't mind me, spumbies. Get out of here. Oh, Aiden, stop checking it. Get out of here. God dang it. You snut. Oh, did I just get new clothing? Hold up, hold up. <laughs> you look stupid. Okay, I uh, got new gloves, new arm braces. Let's see how they look. Oh, yeah, I'm just mixing now. Oh, this hat looks super retarded, dude. Like, you look really stupid. Okay, uh, craft one of these. That way we ha we'll be stocked up. What the? Whoops. I'm messing up everything. Okay, stocked up on that. I want to get this lit windmill real quick. Are you good guys? You're not gonna... Okay, nice. Oh wait, is it already activated? No, I gotta get up here and activate it. That's all right. Well, they gotta make it so complicated. God dang it. Okay, let's see now. Okay. Grab it. Good job, my guy. Good job. Hold on to it. Please, good God, stay holding on to it. Jump! Hurry! Get up there. Ooh, ooh. Okay, gotta grab this one now. And jump over there. Wait for it. Wait for it. Now! 
Good job. All right. Whoo. Oh, I gotta crawl through here. And up the ladder. All right. Another windmill at our disposal. That's it, fellas. Get to work. Okay, I do like how many safe houses there are. So that way, if we ever have to do a nighttime run, we just gotta run up here. Okay, I swear, every time I'm trying to do something, there's always somebody getting their Baconade or something. I mean, I know I don't have to do it, but still, it's annoying sometimes. Got a bed anywhere I can jump on? Yes, there is. <laughs> All right. Back on, what do you got for me, dude? I hear goats. I hear goat. Where is it at? I want to see it. Yeah. There they are. Hey, kid. Some old world folks recorded audio time capsules when they realized the ship was gonna hit the fan. Okay, everybody's talking at once and it's hurting my freaking head. Oh, hack on, you putting me through some crap, aren't you, man? Before I even do anything for you. What is this? Tape. And steal all your freaking goodies. Alright, hack on, what do you got, man? Hack on. Hey, you're a better climber than one crazy girl I used to know. <laughs> she was something. She even wanted to climb the tallest building in the city. The VNC Tower. Was she one of your wives? Almost. Too hot-tempered, even for my tastes. And what about this passage to the center? Right. Look, from this roof, you can clearly see the Peacekeeper's base. Oh, we're going up against the Peacekeepers now. Peacekeepers run this city? So the PK run the city? They sure think they do. That's what they need the uniforms and ranks for. They tattoo them. They're fucking obsessed with hierarchy. <laughs> but they don't control the city. At least not all of it. Who controls the rest? The Colonel. The Renegades. Well, you won't meet them here. For now. What's next? Wait, you brought me here to take a look at the Peacekeepers? The PK are your ticket to the center. I told you the only way to get there is through the metro tunnels. I'll go inside and draw their attention away from the platform. Then you enter the Metro Technical Station. There's an airlock there. We'll take it together to the central loop. We can't just ask them to let me through? No chance. Right now, each new face they see belongs to a suspect in their commander's murder. They know me. I trade with them sometimes. I deliver lamps from the girls, or goods from dark zones. There might be a few infected there. Nothing a pilgrim can't handle, though. When you get to the main station, let me know. Now you better get some sleep. You'll head out at night. Oh, you suck. Infected in the tunnels. What if I turned into a zombie there? You ever think about that, huh? Great. More night running. I mean, I know that's half the fun, but still. Ah, look at that. Seen before. What does it look like? It's, a, it's like a gremlin. No, no, not a big one. Extremely fast. Probably a bolter. You can Aha. find interesting stuff on them. Bolters. But catching one requires serious hunting skills. Now, or a dune buggy. Head for the tunnels. Okay, crouch. I'm guessing this person. Oh, I'm not gonna. I don't like this already. I I don't like this already. Turn on my flashlight. Okay, gotta head down. Don't break your cankles, Aiden. And you broke your cankles. Good job. Excuse me, coming through. Oh no 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 no! Get off of it! I didn't get away from me. Get. Okay, we good? I think so. Okay. Lockpick, hurry up. Get this open, Aiden. Oh my god, dude. There we go. Go, 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 go. Freaking volatile just snatches me down into the hole. Okay, we're good. There's trash down there, right? We should be safe. Or not. Okay. 
Okay, just a few spawn bases. All we should have to worry about, right? A few spawn bases? We good? Ooh, but there are some goodies in here. I didn't demand if I do. Parts for Carlos and his groundbreaking fence. Sunday shoes. Hope he's still waiting at the bazaar. Okay. Oh, there are actually some goodies in here. Nice. I miss the yellow boxes. Okay, what is, uh... Okay, I gotta go that way. Let's do the store. You know, I ever tried kicking down the door? You know, that could help, too. I guess I should better get moving. I'm gonna freaking turn into a spumby. Okay, up in the freaking crevice. Oh, what is that? What is that? Is that a person or is that a spumby? Zombie, oh no. Hey, you be quiet. Awesome. That is something I don't want to deal with. But at the same time, I kind of do. You see, people, if you haven't learned anything about me, I'm very impatient and very lazy when it comes to stuff like this. So I might just, uh, you know, go on and just try running through here and beating the ever-living crap out of whatever's in here. Like Mr. Red Pants right here. Hello. Get out of my face! Ooh! Douche! Screw crap out of me! Can't wait until I get my power hit. Okay, we good? You good, Aiden? Please don't turn into a zombie. I beg of you. Your immunity's low. UV shrooms, okay. gotcha. Now watch out for the infected. There might be a few, or a few dozen. I'm already in the PK base. I'll throw a UV flare through the vent, and you'll see how to get to the main station. Gotcha. Okay, so definitely need to stock up on these mushrooms. Gotcha. But they're all over the ground. Just pick some. Which way do I gotta go? Okay, through there. Sneaky sneak. We're fine. Nothing to worry about. Don't mind me. Just a burrowful man walking through here. Not really. He's butt ugly, but still. Oh my! That's yeah, one way to stay stealthy, Aiden. Just freaking find goodies go. Oh my! Okay, I didn't know. Somehow I totally missed the part about the uh, mushrooms. So we may actually be good if I can do this carefully. Easy. Oh my god, I so want to fight all of them, though. Okay, watch out. These will Oh, turn the light off. Oh, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. You suck! We're out, we're out, we're out, we're out. Go! And I got a lot pick. Fantastic. Okay, gotta kill him. You suck. Okay, get out. A good weapon. Slicey dice. Shut up! I'm not hitting anything. Uh oh. My immunity. Bye bye, two candles. Hey, you should be quiet. Hurry up, Aiden. Aiden, please! This game is like really sick. Hey! Turn it! Die! You good? Open this. I hear another zombie. Oh, god dang it! Douche! Is there another one? You're still alive! Heal? Oh my god. Okay, we're good. We got this. Close that. <sighs> Eat some more freaking mushrooms. Oh, you gotta be joking. Come on. Get out of my face. Just die. Die. Oh my god, why do I gotta go through all this? It's not my playstyle. Shut it. I'm busy trying to do stuff. Bring it. Oh, 
Okay, we're good. Hey! You're not supposed to be alive! I wanna pick up all this stuff. Ah. Uh, okay, we're good. No power. Fantastic. We're almost through that. I think we're good. Need some more mushrooms. Ah, uh, close that. Close that. Oh, God. oh my god. Can I just run? Yeah, screw this. Take those mushrooms. I know I'm probably gonna be skipping over a lot of stuff, but it's not that I can get out of my face. Really make up. Oh my god, that is something I don't want to deal with. You knock that off. Hold up. Okay, we're good. Haha. -ha. I got to the flare. Look around. Nice. The technical tunnel to the main station should be well lit. I've already lured the guards upstairs. I'll chat them up while you get inside. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Oh my god. Oh, Yay, my favorite. Freaking gargoyles. Ah, <sighs> now I'd usually deal with these guys. If I could bow and arrow or something. Oh no, get over there, Turin. You knock crap off. Eat your freaking bacon. You, get out of my face. Take your kinkles. Knock it off. Oh! Okay, they're just gonna keep coming through here. Go. Ah, oh, of course you get a lot picket. Why don't you? We good for now? Okay. Go ahead, lock with the door. There we go. Got it. Ah, okay. Shut that. Lord have mercy. Uh-oh. The hole. In the vent you go. Come on, let's go. Oh, I keep pressing the wrong button. Oh, I see one of these bad boys. I got it. I'm inside. Five packs. Think about it, and I'll be right back. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I'm on the platform. Open the airlock. I'll be there in a second. Where at? Where? Okay. It's not that gotta hide from, right? Something feels off. Hey, why are you? Uh oh. Ow. That hurt. Thank you for that, sir. Uh oh. Please don't turn into a Spombi Aiden. Was I supposed to look for enemies before doing that? He's awake. Can I help you? What were you doing at our base? 
I'm only trying to get to the city center. The center? <laughs> the tunnel's gonna be closed until you hand over Lucas's killers. Bizarre scum. Well, people are always making assumptions, aren't they? How is it that you lost all nothing, heard nothing, and you managed to forget about the ban on passage? Maybe we'll start punishing you by cutting off your hands. That would improve your memory, huh? What were you doing four days ago? I'm a pilgrim. Four days ago, I was a hundred kilometers away. Enough, Anderson. We need the truth, and you won't get it through coercion. But Commander Lucas, Lucas always said- Lucas is dead, and now I'm in command. You've read the reports. A pilgrim appeared in the bazaar yesterday. It looks like he's not lying. Leave us, Sergeant. I want to talk to him alone. Ah, good cop, I'm guessing, right? Yay! <clears throat> Thank you. Those were hurting my hands. Where did you come from? A hundred kilometers away, didn't you hear me? From Crossdale River. That's over 1,500 kilometers from here. It's actually more than 2,000. The freeway bridges collapsed. There are no straight paths. And you've managed to make it so far away. Impressive. What's it like out there these days? When was the last time you were outside the city? What do you think? Why do you think I killed him? Uh... When was the last time you were out of the city? About 15 years ago. And there were that many fewer survivors. And that many more infected. Stands to reason. Most people endure living in this hellhole because what's out there has got to be so much worse. My wife and I lived in England. I can I tell. Two sisters, two brothers. Haven't heard from them for ten years. Where did they live? In and around London. From what I've been told, London doesn't exist. There may be four settlements left on the entire island. Fucking hell. Why do you think I killed... Why do you think I killed anyone? Why would anyone think I killed your commander? You tried to escape to the central loop four days after the murder. Besides, if I were Carl, I'd hire a stranger to kill Lucas too. It's the cleanest way. Well, I don't know who Carl is. Oh, you'll find out soon enough. Carl keeps both hands on the steering wheel. He's a faux sanctimonious prick who's turning the entire bazaar against us, even though we protect them. Outlands are dangerous. What's it like outside the walls? You never know where danger's gonna come from. Always new territories, new threats. And you came here to take shelter. I came here because I'm looking for someone. And a lot of people are said to have survived in Villador. You're looking for someone? Maybe I can help you, but not for free. I'm used to trading. What do you need? No nonsense. That's good. The tunnel will be closed until I find our commander's murderer, Commander Lucas. It sounds fair. Found in the bazaar. Horribly mutilated. The people of the bazaar aren't making this easy. They're proud and loyal. They refuse to turn anyone in. But command has lost its patience. I have orders from the top, Pilgrim. If the inhabitants of Old Vilador continue to revolt, our army will come here and burn the bazaar to the ground. Now, I'd rather avoid that. And what do you need from me? Lucas had a weapon, a rare set of brass knuckles called the Lazarus. This is the key to finding the killer. If you learn anything about the Lazarus, tell me, and I will most certainly return the favor. It's worth a lot. And we didn't find it on his body. I think someone from the bazaar may have appropriated it. Alright. Why should I trust you? Well, I mean, that's a stupid question. He's giving you a pretty good deal right there, dude. What gun say? Why should I work with you? You attacked me and accused me of murder with no proof whatsoever. Our mistake. You're clearly not the murderer. Why can't you investigate on your own? I hardly know anyone here. That's exactly why you can help me. Nobody will talk to us. To them, we're occupiers. The fact that we clear the streets of the infected and catch criminals doesn't matter. What matters is that we eat the their graphics food look and amazing. Their yes. water. But you, you're a pilgrim. There are many 
only ways you can help people, and you're from the outside, they can trust you. They tried to kill me. Nah, look, we are your only chance if you want to get to the center, that is. So, will you help me? Uh, yeah, why not? Uh, I have my own affairs. You know what? Yeah, I'll give, I'll, I'll, I'll give him him. He's giving you a pretty good deal. Just go find some brass knuckles and all that crap. I think it'll be good. So if I find that weapon, you'll let me through to the center? It's not that easy. Vilador suffered much. First, it was isolated from the outside world because of infection. Then the walls became its salvation. But people here learned not to trust easily. I won't open the passage until I've called the killer. But if you can find the Lazarus, I'll remember that. You'll be the first one through once justice is done. Sounds fair. Sounds as if I have no other choice. I'll try. Look around. Ask people. And don't come back empty-handed. Good luck. All right. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and leave this episode off here, guys. Uh, I'm, I, I think I'm pretty sure I made the right decision, trusting the peacemakers. Peace, peacekeepers? Peacemaker? Whatever the heck their name is. Pe for freaking stupid crap. But, uh, yeah, uh, this is pretty freaking stealth all the time. It's not my freaking style, but what the heck. I need to I need to practice it more. But good lord, it's so freaking time-consuming. And lord have mercy, I have just better luck running straight through everything. Also, are there goodies in here? No? If you guys did end up enjoying this episode of Dying Light 2, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.